Before I start this video, I just want to say thank you to all the people who commented on the last video. So everybody's getting a shout out and uh, I might do it in this video as well for the next one. Um, so yeah, um, sorry if I butcher everybody's names. So Blakely Moore and Sushi and Green Tea, Eddie Formaster and uh, Kevin Spee and David Nick Elick, mate. <laughs> uh, Lego Last Lego MOC Review. Uh, programmer 57 cow production channel pito javier i'm so sorry uh, miss ararius or something i i z m o ivan xx ivan xx nick slick i like that name nick slick um, oh no he sounds yeah I don't like that name anymore. <laughs> uh, random. There's Jordy Calvin. There's Sean Less. There's iGaming. There's Dragon G. There's Bade. There's Red Rose. There's Terras Langing. I'm sorry, mate. Get so good gaming. There's Honey Gray Sambo. There is Michael J. Caboose. And X Game Tail 12. It's Atara. Masty, I'm sorry. Uh, I'm Jad. Line, 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 line. X, 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 D, A. I'm sorry. Patience Brown. That's what I mean. Lin, Lin Sky. I can't read, by the way. I'm so sorry. Uh, Lava Ball. Michael Lang. R, M, T. Big shout out to this guy. He's like my only Patreon. So, he's awesome, okay? Literally, he's my only Patreon. He, he like supports me on everything. He supports me on my new Instagram, on my Twitter, everything. Awesome guy. Um, next person is Itan Safatari. This is Fantafatari. That's my boy. That's my boy. Martin Sorelli and Win Solo and Laura Goodrich. Give me some of those riches. I need some. MT Player and Dylan Hearn. Hearn. <laughs> and Michael McCulloch what a name so there you go there's all the people that commented on my last video so big shout out to all you guys without further ado let's build this awesome survival small tiny house okay and slap a like on the video if you want and leave a comment you might get a shout out so yeah Minecraft house tutorial today we will be building this small cute compact survival house now we're going to do this step by step all the things you will need are in here so a quiche we need 15 blocks 15 of the stairs we need 45 a quiche wood slabs we need two chests we need three pieces of glass we need one a quiche fence and one furnace one crafting table three flowers of your choice three grass blocks or just dirt blocks 19 cobblestone one bed four torches and five wooden trapdoors so that's all you will need so we're going to start off we'll get these in where what the, what what's happening why is there a pig doing that to me right so we're going to start off we're going to need our cobblestone to start off i'm going to try and get everything we'll get some of that we'll get our torches as well we'll get a bed We'll get these in our other part. I think there's a faster way. There we go. So we'll need a five by seven area. And we're going to start off with our cobblestone. We'll place one here and one here. Now, one thing I did forget is we're going to need a door. Essential people. So what we're going to do is we're going to go on the inside here. Place our door right there. Open it up and close it. So now we're going to grab our cobblestone. We're going to count one, two, three, four. Now we're going to go around to the right hand side and count one, two, three, four. We're going to go around to the other side now and we're going to place one, two, three, four, and then we can close the gap together. Okay, so we've got our first level done. You can pause the video if you're still getting that done and we'll move on to the next step. 
So the next step, what we're going to do in this right hand side corner at the front of the house, we're going to place one Akisha block. Now what we can do is replace the flooring. So just take all this flooring out here as well. And we're going to place our Akisha blocks down. That's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen down on the floor. Now, as you can see, we've got a little bit more of a pattern going around here with our stairs. So we're going to grab our stairs now. We're going to place one here and one here, either side of the door. And then we're going to grab our glass. So to get the glass, how do I do it? I'm not sure. Um, we'll grab our glass here because we've already got the door. We're going to have three blocks of glass. One, two, three, just like that. And now we can grab our dirt block and just put it underneath the glass right there. So what we're going to do now, we're going to get our trapdoors. We've got the glass, so we can put that away. Put a trapdoor here and close it. Three across here. Close them. And then one here. And then you can decide if you want to place your flowers on there. One, two, three, just like that. So we're on to the next step now. Okay, for our next step, we're going to have to jump onto here and we're going to place one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, just like that. Now we can put an eighth one there just at the side of it. So it should be overhanging like that. So you should have a shape like that. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to count one, two, three, four, five and stop where the end window is. Okay, so we're going to go around to this side now. And we're going to grab our stairs because we're going to run these stairs going all the way around. So get your Akisha stairs at the ready. We're going to count one, two, three, four, and then curl it round. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Curl it round again. Eleven, twelve, thirteen, and it should fit into there perfectly. So what we're going to do now is we're going to grab our half slabs and we're going to go to the back of the building. One, two, three four just like that as you can see it just ends at that bit and then we're going to bring this across by one two three four five six seven with the akisha slabs and then join it together at this side now you're going to have to get a dirt block or something to get onto the roof and now we can start to fill it all in so basically you're just filling it all in so one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. We have got the roof complete and we're on to the inside. Or maybe not. Before I forget, we'll get a Keisha fence and just place a little torch on there just so we can light it up. What you can do is you can go around the place and you can put little bits of light where you've got those bits. And let's go to the inside. Okay, let's go inside now. So at the side here, I'm going to place a bed. So get your bed ready and put it there. Now, I'm going to put a crafting table at the side here. I'm going to get a wooden trapdoor, place it there, and we place a chest here. Now at this side here, I'm going to place another chest, and then I'm going to place my furnace right there. And then what you can do, it's entirely up to you, you can decide to put some carpet down if you want to collect some carpet, or what you can do is put another little chest there by the bed. And this is literally everything you will need for just starting out in Minecraft. Obviously, later on, I've left a space right here. So what you can do is grab your trapdoor. This is an extra trapdoor. Place it there. And later on, you can dig down and put your enchantment table there. Or you could move on to a more advanced house. And I will put a more advanced house on the screen now. Maybe an intermediate house. So after you've built this and you've adapted and you want to move to the next place, then you can definitely build that that's on the screen now. So I shall catch you in the next video. Make sure you slap a like on the video. It really does help me out. And remember to leave a comment and I will shout out someone at the very end of the next video. So peace out to everyone. Big shout out to Jaden. Peace. Oh, and before I go, I just want to let you guys know that I've got a new Instagram where I do photography. I will put a link down to it in the description. It's Pixel Vanity. And um, yeah, basically I edit photos for models and stuff. It's something I really, really enjoy and I'm very passionate about it. So that's a before and there's some afters here. Um, but yeah, some is my photography, some is like other people's photography. But I just really enjoy doing this um, and being creative. So if you're quite a creative person, um, definitely get over there. I do talk to people.
people over there so um yeah i do have like a story and stuff that i put up so you'll get to see me and whatever not that you'd want to but yeah um it's just something i really enjoy and i just like sharing with people so if you want to check that out you're more, more than welcome but if not that's cool right see you in the next video peace